In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix slow download speeds in the Xbox app. So if you're trying to download either an app or a game in the Xbox store and you're getting slow download speeds, then there's a few different ways that we can fix this. So the first thing you need to do is come over to your desktop and head over to the start menu. And from here, you're just going to search for Windows security and click this. Once you're in the Windows security section, click on virus and threat protection, then scroll down to virus and threat protection settings and click manage settings. Then from here, right at the top, Top, you'll see real-time protection and you just need to make sure this is turned off like so now just disabling this one thing should speed up your download speeds in your Xbox app however this won't work for everyone so if it's still slow for you what you will need to do is head back over to the start menu search for settings and then click on the settings window from the left hand side select Windows update and then select advanced options then scroll down to the additional options section and click on delivery optimization and if you scroll down to download options you want to change this drop down to absolute bandwidth limit now this is going to stop any throttling on your download speeds and you can also do the same for upload options as well and you basically just want to make sure this option here limit as a percentage of measured bandwidth is turned off so once you've changed these settings we're then going to head over to apps from the left hand side click on installed apps and using the search box type in xbox once you've found the xbox store click on the three horizontal dots next to it and select advanced options then we're going to scroll down to the reset section and we're just going to go through all three of these options so first of all you need to press the repair button and then just give that a few seconds to run then we're going to hit the reset button now don't worry as you won't lose any of your download progress and just by doing the repair and reset that should have now fixed any of your download speeds so you can now try launching back up the Xbox app and checking to see if that's now fixed the issue if you have tried everything and it's still not working you can try uninstalling and reinstalling the application this is kind of a last resort but again it can help with download speeds and it's as simple as that guys hopefully by following all of these steps that's now improved your download speeds if you did find this video helpful then let me know in the comments below and i'll see you in the next one